Have you ever wanted to make a difference, but you didn't know how? EDA is the way to go. The Estel uh, Development Alliance is such a passionate organization and the folks involved are passionate about helping our community. EDA is important um, because it is probably a more big picture aspect um, with community development. We have a bunch of organizations that focus on specific things like Chamber of Commerce on Business, Estel Action Group on utilizing the natural resources we have as far as entertainment goes, um, River City Players, uh, harnesses, not only entertainment for the community, but they also bring in you know, people and students for workshops. But the EDA is important because it, it helps harness those groups um, and combine them to, to make a greater outcome for the community. I think every single community needs to have some type of organization that's not looking at necessarily today or looking at ways specifically to bring in tax income to the community, although those are very important, they need to be looking at tomorrow, the next generation. So the meetings we're having today may not have anything to do with something that changes in Estel in our lifetime, but hopefully these kids, the next generation, two or three generations from now, they'll see the work that we're doing and, and how it impacts. We're always moving, changing, growing, learning, and we have a great group of folks. They're constantly looking for grants, for uh, things that we can bring into our community and make better. It is not a group of people that know nothing about the community. That it is not people sitting in an office somewhere, maybe even geographically neutral, that's saying, oh, I think Estill County needs this, or it looks like Estill County has transportation issues, so let's help them. These are the people you see every day. These are the people you see Friday night in the football stands or at the basketball games or Saturday at the band competitions. These are the people that are in the community, making the community or working in the community and want this community to survive and grow. We've grown. We've grown so much. Um, and I'm so very proud of the growth that we've done and the things that we have accomplished and the dollar amounts that we have managed to put out into the community to better everyone's community, everybody's neighborhood. Out of the thousands of dollars that we have secured, none of it can be used on salaries, none of it can be used to pay for our insurance, to keep the lights on, to put toner in the copier, <laughs> you know, it can't be used for any of that. Um, so while we are pleased and honored to have been able to secure that funding to make life better for everybody, we really want to make payroll. <laughs> we really want to make payroll because without, without our employees at the EDA, we can't do this. You know, volunteers help when they can and with all of their heart and soul, but they can't be there for all of the meetings to make all the relationships and connections that you have to know to find out about all of these great things that we can pass on to everybody else. So it, it is so very important that we get your donations because without them, we can't function. My name is Yvonne Harrison and I'm the chair of the Estel Development Alliance. I contribute and I really hope that you can too. Thank you. Hi, I'm Christina Vaughn with Century 21 Advantage Realty. Uh, I support EDA and I hope you will too. Hi, my name's Trina Stocker and I'm the president of Mercy Health Markham and Wallace Hospital. I give to EDA because I care about my community and I hope you would too.